On behalf of the 65,000 students and 8,500 employees in Conroe ISD, we welcome you to the 2020 Salute to Our Veterans program. Today and every day, we say thank you to you and your families for both your service and your sacrifice on behalf of this great nation. We hope that you enjoy today's program and I encourage you to share it with your friends and family across this great nation. Welcome to the Conroe Independent School District's annual salute to the veterans. I'm Cadet Captain Abila, the Battalion S3 Operations Officer for the Conroe High School Army Junior ROTC. On behalf of the Conroe Independent School District and its joint Junior ROTC programs, we invite you to join us today to help honor the veterans who have served and sacrificed so much for the United States throughout its great 244-year history. We pay respect to our veterans who have served in every theater of conflict and every war, all in the great defense of the greatest nation on earth. Today, we want to pay a special tribute to the brave veterans who laid down their lives defending this nation so that we may live in freedom. Please join me in welcoming the Conroe High School Choir, directed by Evan Key, as they perform the United States National Anthem, The Star Spangled Banner. It is my honor to introduce this group of students who one day may be leading sailors around the world in the United States Navy. This state champion unit was activated in 2000 and is led by Lieutenant Commander Raleigh Stahl and Aviation Mechanic Chief Donald Arms. The students in the program learn to develop leadership and teamwork skills and how to embody the core values of the United States Navy, honor, courage, and commitment. Please welcome Caney Creek High School Navy Junior ROTC Program. I am Cadet Aguilar and I am a proud member of the Caney Creek NJ ROTC Program. Our organization strives to create a community upholding values of honor, courage, commitment, and citizenship. Caney Creek's ROTC organization is made up of many teams including armed and unarmed, color guard, air rifle, and PT. Our teams promote teamwork, discipline, and integrity. With 20 years in the books, we have not only created an extraordinary organization, but we have created a family. On this day, we would like to honor all veterans, both past and present. Our country's greatness is built on the foundation of your courage and bravery. We are sincerely grateful for your sacrifice and dedication to our country. Thank you for ensuring our freedoms. We salute you. It is my pleasure to introduce the Conroe High School Army Junior ROTC Program led by Captain Kevin Williams, Command Sergeant Major Robert Barty, and First Sergeant Xavier Whitehead. The program began in 2001 and has been awarded the Honor Unit of Distinction five times. In the JROTC program, we strive to create the leaders of tomorrow. Our main focus is to help build cadets up by teaching them valuable skills that can be applied throughout their life, such as leadership, communication, and decision-making skills. Here in our program, we make sure our cadets build a, build a steady path toward the future. Skills are built along with many fun memories and friendships. 
We offer many after-school teams that you can be a part of, such as physical training, otherwise known as PT, marksmanship, color guard, unarmed drill, arm drill, JLAP, and spirit flag. Joining a team is a fun way to build teamwork skills and make great memories. Throughout the school year, we participate in many events like competitions, football games, parades, and many more. In this program, we make a positive impact on our community by taking part in service learning projects. Part of the service learning project is the appreciation of certain parts of our community, like our veterans. With that, we take this moment to thank our veterans for what they have done. Thank you for your service. On this day, we honor all current and active service members in the armed forces. I am grateful for your contributions not only to your state, but to our country. I am grateful for the opportunity to grow and develop in the JROTC program. Thank you for your service and all the sacrifice you have done for this country. Thank you for your bravery, your sacrifice, and the example you have set for us. In short, we thank you. Thank you for protecting our rights and our liberties for this country. Thank you for protecting the country and making our lives better. Thank you for literally you risking your lives to make our lives go on better. That's why we want to say thank you. Dr. Ted Landry, the principal of the Woodlands High School, Lance Corporal, United States Marine Corps, 1987 to 1990. While I was in the Marine Corps, I had the distinct honor of being a presidential guard uh, at the White House, Camp David, and Marine Barracks 8th and I in Washington, D.C. It was a fantastic opportunity for a young Marine infantryman like myself. Uh, it gave me an opportunity to serve my country, uh, and I'm very fortunate to have, to have done that. Please welcome the Woodlands High School Choir, directed by Patrick Newcomb, with their moving performance of Lee Greenwood's God Bless the USA. Just my children and my wife. I thank my lucky stars to be living here today. Cause the flag still stands for freedom. And they can't take that away.
Founded in 2014, the Woodlands College Park Marine Corps Junior ROTC is a four-time Naval Honor School and has been named National Drill and Academic Champions. The program is led by Lieutenant Colonel Nicole Mowry and Sergeant Major Chris Combs. Thank you to all members of our military, past and present, living and dead. To all those who have served and those who have continued to serve, happy Veterans Day. Happy Veterans Day to our soldiers, both past and present. We owe you our thanks, but more than that, we owe you our freedom. There's no way to thank our veterans for everything they sacrificed for our freedom, but on Veterans Day, we have to try. So thank you to all our servicemen and women, both past and present. Forward, march, left, right, left, right, left, right, left. To all the veterans out there, we salute you. Thank you for your service and sacrifice. The United States Army, the United States Navy, the United States Air Force, the United States Marine Corps. Um, well, the short answer is because my dad told me to. And the not so short answer is because I wanted to go to college. I think that's a really common thing that people say. The reason I wanted to join the military is pretty simple. It was an opportunity to serve our great country, uh, also to give back to those who had sacrificed everything for us. Uh, also, it was a great opportunity to, to grow personally, as well as become a first generation college student in, in my family. I joined the Marine Corps because, uh, because I enjoy the, uh, our great country and the freedoms uh, that it gives us, and I wanted my opportunity to serve. I joined the Navy following my father and his father, who had both been in the military, and I joined for the training that was available. I was in the nuclear power field. I joined the military because every time I heard the national anthem, I would get emotional, and I wanted to have a sense of pride and accomplishment. I was studying in seminary. I found out about the program to serve in the chaplain corps, and that's uh, why I decided to do this. Um, I, I figured, why not help souls? Uh, and so with the Chaplain Corps, it's, it was a good opportunity for me to do that. But service has always been in my heart. It's one of the reasons why I'm a teacher. And that was my experience. And I, I, I suggest that anybody that's, that's thinking about it should, should definitely give it a shot. I served in the United States military because as a first generation American, my mom and my dad taught me the value of living in this country and all the freedoms and the opportunities it afforded us. I was very thankful to grow up here and I was very thankful to serve. I joined the service to not only better myself, but to continue a family tradition. I decided to join the military, the Navy in particular, because of the sense of adventure and the challenge that I felt going to sea could provide. Exploring the world by ship, navigating by the stars to distant and far off lands. I joined the military uh, because I wanted to serve my country and I wanted to serve this great state of Texas. At the time I was going to college, uh, I had just graduated with a two-year degree 
At that point, I wanted to do something important with my life and serving my country seemed like a, a good idea. Um, I joined the Army Reserve for a couple of reasons. Um, my grandfathers served in World War II and my father was in the Army when I was little. I was born uh, in Fort Hood, Texas. And um, also, um, I needed some money for college when I came out of high school. Uh, I was paying uh, for all of my own education and uh, they were offering a really good deal and so I thought I'd put two and two together and join the Army Reserve. It didn't, it didn't turn out exactly like the way I thought it was going to be, but it was way better in a lot of ways and I, I'm very honored to have served. The Oak Ridge High School Air Force Junior ROTC is the oldest Conroe ISD program having been established in 1995. The program is presently led by Lieutenant Colonel Lynn Bentley and Master Sergeant Jimmy Twine. This unit has received over 20 significant awards, including being named the overall champion at the National Drill Team Championship on three separate occasions. On behalf of Air Force Junior ROTC, thank you for your service. The Woodlands High School Air Force Junior ROTC was created in 2006. It is presently led by Lieutenant Colonel Chris McMartin, Chief Master Sergeant Dan Chifu, and Chief Master Sergeant Rick Robertson. The unit has earned a national level recognition every year since 2008. to introduce the Woodlands College Park High School Choir and Orchestra conducted by Peter Kempter, performing songs from our five service branches in this moving service medley. You will also see various Conroe ISD employees who are veterans of these branches of service. <laughs> Boys, boy, boy, he's a beautiful 
Bye.